630 Monday morning. Thank you for joining us here on Good Day. I'm John Langler. This has been our main breaking news all morning. Several big stories this afternoon, and we start in the East Valley, where Metro Police say road rage may have led to a woman's murder. Live from Valley's Grand Ballroom, as we are ready for tonight's Democratic presidential debate next door over at Paris, all ahead of Saturday's caucus. John Langler with you here. This is the media room as the journalists and reporters are assembled are getting ready for what happens tonight. Should be very interesting. An active shooter situation at the Route 91 Harvest, a country music festival. Again, three days uh, down on the south end of the Las Vegas Strip. Reports of several people who have been shot. So this morning, one of the most congested, popular, best known streets in the world. It's a lot quieter. Every casino on Las Vegas Boulevard is now closed at the request of Governor Steve Sisolak. It is 7 o'clock here on a Thursday morning. Thanks for joining us on Good Day. We're going to stay on live here to cover a little bit more of the snow coverage. Is that a coyote out there? This is a live picture, oh by the way, goodness. from Red Rock. See on the middle of the snow in the median. Yes. The key part of the chicken sandwich being the pieces around it right. are gone. <laughs> all right, so wait a second. Here's the idea, Alex. Diane, maybe you and I, we, all three of us can get them together. Mm. What if we bring our own I'll bread? Get some Popeyes and make our own sandwich. Yeah. yeah. And just do it ourselves. Guys. This is our imaginary wine. It's our imaginary uh, 617 in the morning wine. It's also known as water. Yes, please. From the, from we the want tap. you to know this is water. Okay, some folks mm. suggest that it could be another clear. No, this was a, it was a good year for, for water this yes, year. You spent a lot of time here. You were not on the debate stage earlier in the week. Uh, will the results today have an effect on your long-term future in this Democratic race? You see behind me people are gathering here at the Government Center downtown for the sunrise ceremony, which will begin at about 7 o'clock. I'm joined by Corinne Burke, who was out the Route 91 Harvest Festival two years ago today. Uh, you've come here for the sunrise ceremony, um, I guess, what are your thoughts now, two years later? So let's talk about uh, the similarities and the differences between Iowa and Nevada, not only in terms of just the caucus process and the voting process, but the demographics. Obviously, there's a lot of differences between the two states. Alice, we've got to get you to a Golden Knights game. Another one. You haven't been to one yet, have you? Yeah, we went together. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> wow, Langler. Oops. Did you already forget? <laughs> Excuse me while I... <laughs> Try and press rewind on our life. <laughs> That's right. You must hold it by the rubber part, not by the stick. As you do. <laughs> oh, you one more shot. There it is. Oh! <laughs> You're hired. Very, very good. I want to thank the Academy for this wonderful award. <laughs> I'd try it again. You think it'll be better maybe in this setting? No, it'll give it work. <laughs> Dip it in the whipped cream, maybe. That'll cover the. No, just do this way. Oh my gosh, John! Oh! <laughs> you know, I think you'd be a good ambassador to Pringles. 